Oh, we're saying this direct to camera? What are we yeah. saying? We're the Fab Five from Netflix and Square Eye. Yes! yes. My name is John Campbell. I manage the LA Nerds team at Netflix. So John works in the IT department at Netflix and they call them nerds. We love nerds. Did you know we were crash for today? Hey, I'm Bobby. Alan? Have you all noticed how cluttered this is? How are you working in all yeah. this clutter? Can we just start moving this? Like, this is the... So word on the street is, is that John works at like the nerds department at Netflix. Do I know what that is? No. Do I need their help? 100%. How do I delete all of those old topless pictures off the internet? I don't want any more. So basically we're making over the king of the nerds? Clearly, he needs some help. Oh Clearly? God. You're channeling Goat Boy 1990 SNL. <laughs> John is kind of like Tanya Harding before she really worked on her grace and artistry. Like she had a really fierce triple and it was great. I just need him to like grace it out a little bit. I know that John's your manager, right? Yes. yes. Does he open up to you guys about like, how he feels in like a good leader. Yeah. He told us he loved us today. Yeah, he did. He oh, sent us an email. He that's... told us he loved us today. It was amazing. That's beautiful. Oh, that John seems very kind, loving, and supportive, but I feel like he can even get to a place where he's even more confident about the man he is. All yeah. together. Yas, queen. Yas, queen. In the little sheet I got to learn about you, mm -hmm. you wrote something that I thought was really interesting. You wrote, I'm scared to let my team down. Can you tell me why you wrote that? What I mean by not letting them down is I just wouldn't want to keep them from something or keep them away from an opportunity. Have you ever worked in a space where you felt like people let you down? Yeah, I have. And yeah. what was that like for you? It just feels like someone's not got your back. Yeah. I have, a, I have a fear of feeling left out or I have a fear of not having my back watched. So I think that's something that I'm putting in as far as the way I manage. I have an idea for you. Okay. You, you, you trust me? Yeah. All right, yeah. good. I want to show him what it's like to see the different components and start to combine them and maybe see a little, a different way of eating or of approaching food. I know you love burgers, but I'm here to teach you how to combat the 3 p.m. blues. Carrot sticks. This is like wake me up food. It's good for you, it's very guilt free, but it's kind of boring on its own and they tend to be a little dry. You take lemon with a little plastic knife, you squeeze some lemon juice, and then for the crunch, I know that you're trying to bulk up. Almonds, really good source of protein. This is finishing salt, but it's smoked, so try that. So it's crunchy, it's mm -hmm. smoky, it tastes like, you know those smoked almonds that you get in airplanes? Totally does, yeah. yeah. So try the carrot with the salt and an almond. Oh, yeah. So you have your crunchy, you mm -hmm. have your acid, you have your sweet from the carrot, it sort of like covers all your bases. That is really good. No, I'll show this to the rest of the nerds too. You show it to the nerds. I will. So, I feel like this beard is wearing you instead of you wearing your beard. Like, I feel like I'm losing my John John in here and I want to see who he is. Basically, I think that you have a gorgeous full head of hair. I love your natural color. I would never color your hair in a million years no matter how much money you wanted to pay me because I think it's so perfect and beautiful the way it is. Really? You have great texture and I just want to introduce you to some product and I want to kind of like tweak the shape of your haircut to like go with the face a little more, but I'm really not mad at it. We just got to like bring up this beautiful man. Whoa! <laughs> hey! That's what you fantastic! Think? I love it! It's awesome, right? Man, that is great. Damn. Yeah, now I, every morning I don't have to get up and go, <sighs> And look at Tani! Hey! Look. What do you think? <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks so good! Gorge, right? Wow, what a difference. Yeah. There's major potential here. I know that we can take him from looking like a drab dad to something a little more fab. Now that you're looking all handsome and appropriate, yeah. we've got to take care of the rest of it. As I said, on the whole, you don't need a massive change. You look great, but let's step it up just a little bit more. Oh, yes. You said that your style icon was Bruce Springsteen. Yeah. Okay, in the 80s, he was wearing a lot of industrial style clothes. Colors are favorites, and I love, yeah. it is springsteen -y. I love it. Oh, I mean, nice. I dig, I dig this big time. Yeah, yeah, get it, get it, spin, spin, yes, yes. All right, yes. Oh, that looks good. Yeah. Uh, yeah.
I can't wait for the fellow nerds to see you in this. Are you excited to show them? Very excited. Okay, I want you to feel your best. I want you to look your best. Sound Perfect. good? Yeah. All right, let's great. go. more functional. I don't just want this space to be functional for the nerds, but when other team members from Netflix come up to get their stuff fixed, I want them to have a place where they can chill and talk to the nerds because everyone loves the nerds. You know, I didn't want to make this feel like a house because at the end of the day, it's a workspace. So I gave you some more surfaces. I didn't put stuff on them because I know that you will do that for me. <laughs> the one thing that I would ask for John out of this experience is that he actually grows as a person that he knows that the person that he is is fully amazing, and that he walks away feeling confident, feeling loved, and feeling supported. John, you ready? Yeah. 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 What do you guys think? Come, give us your best runway. Come on, yeah. best runway. So John shared with me that he feels a bit of anxiety and fear that he's letting you guys down and that he's sort of on the outside of your team. And so for me, I wanna make sure that he knows not only with this new makeover, that his team is supporting him and loves him just as much as he loves you all. So can you tell me, do you love and support John? Yeah! All right, so we're gonna go on for a trust circle and what I want you to do is just to show John as much love. This way you always know your team has your back. Whoa. No okay, longer do you have to have that fear. So on the count of three, show him as much love as you possibly can. One, two, three! Yeah!